Here we are at 1521 North Adams Street, which is just on the outskirts of Happy Valley and uh, Midtown Brandywine. We're uh, right adjacent to the Brandywine River. And this is a, a unique property for the city of Wilmington. It's a newer single family home that was custom built. The layout of the house is very open. Um, a majority of the home was built with repurposed materials um, from local places like the Trinity Episcopal Church. We, it is um, platinum lead, was built with platinum lead guidelines for energy efficiency. Um, it has a central vacuum, has a, a on-demand hot water heater, uh, just a lot of great, special, unique custom features. And the owners did something very unique at this property. Um, their uh, need was for a two-car garage, uh, so they really took advantage of all of the space here by installing a lift within the one-car garage space. So the garage does accommodate two cars. You just move the first car out, you hit the button, and the uh, lift comes down with the second car. The one great thing about 1521 North Adams Street is all of the outdoor space that they've incorporated into the construction. And um, within the house, as we've mentioned before, they've repurposed a lot of materials. This is an I-beam from the local Trinity Episcopal Church that was reutilized so you can stand over the pond. All of the um, cabinets in the kitchen are repurposed from the Trinity Episcopal Church, which is here in Wilmington. The flooring is from a repurposed wood flooring from a uh, place in Baltimore called Second Chance. All of the um, cabinets were obviously made um, exclusively for this house. You have all of your hidden outlets in the bottom here. Again, this was all custom built for this particular home, utilizing the space as best the space as best as we could. And because um, you know the um, dining rooms aren't utilized uh, full time for for um, with a homeowner usually. So what we what the homeowners have done here, it's a special feature. They have a dining room um, table units that you can put down here and pull it out and have a very large um, dinner party. And the gas fireplace, uh, the mantle again repurposed from the Trinity Episcopal Church here in Wilmington. And then off of the living room we have the office or the den and just you know maximizing the space you have your pocket doors so you don't have the opening and shutting of the doors. The floors here were also repurposed flooring from the Second Chance store in Baltimore. Down um, a half a flight of steps from the living room, you'll find the half bathroom again with a pocket door, um, very special fixtures that work well within a small half bathroom. And on the second level, we're gonna find the master bedroom area and two additional um, guest bedrooms. The two um, bedroom hallway bedrooms here have the oak flooring, the repurposed flooring. And then the hallway and your master bedroom have the repurposed cherry flooring. So on the second level, um, for, for convenience, we, you have your laundry um, facility. And down here, you have your guest bathroom. And as we enter the master bedroom, we're greeted by this great outdoor space. It's great to sit and have coffee, overlooks the Brandywine River. Lots of great views from this house, lots of nice natural light. 
going to come back into the master bedroom. And as I mentioned, this is the repurposed cherry hardwood flooring. And here's a great electric fireplace. Creates a lot of nice ambiance in the room. And the master bedroom does have its private bath. And the master bedroom walk-in closet, again, utilizes the uh, prayer book holders from the pews for, um, for the shoe holders, which is a really great thing. Within the master bedroom, you have your vanity sink. And just to mention again, a lot of the vanity wood is again repurposed from the Trinity Episcopal Church. And then the tile shower has multiple jets. We've turned on the jets in the master shower so you can see. And now we're going to step out on the uh, green roof, the one of two green roofs in the home. The home really maximizes all the outdoor space. Again, you have great views of the Brandywine River and the Brandywine Park. And this is the catwalk I mentioned we were under before when we were in the lower level courtyard. And then that truly is live um, grass that grows up here, which is a really wonderful feature. So now we're going to take, go up to the third level of the home, which again, the uh, stairway remains open, which keeps with the whole open feel of the home. Again, all the repurposed wood utilized for the stairway. And one thing I do want to mention are all the recessed stairway lights here, which is a really nice feature. The third floor right now is set up as a, a family or sitting room or office, but it could serve as a second master bedroom. And here uh, we have a, uh, a second room. Right now it's being used as a home office space but this could easily be used as a master bedroom, bedroom sitting or TV area. And this is the second master bathroom in the home. And I do wanna show you the really special shower that we have in here, the large overhead jets. And then here we have another um, shower stall with the uh, ceramic pebble tile floor and the glass gray tiles. And this is the uh, third level rooftop garden. There's a huge uh, fireplace unit out here that is operated by gas. Creates a lot of great heat. Again, wonderful views of the Brandywine Park and the Brandywine River. You can see the second level rooftop garden, and then also the first floor courtyard there.